I have to say that there are aspects of it, of course, that, that you miss, and there are aspects that you don't miss. Uh, the reality is that at the time I went to the Court of Appeals, which is my predecessor position here to the Supreme Court, I was 44 years of age, and I was ready to do something different. Um, but that is, should not be interpreted as dissatisfaction with what I was then doing. I had a general law practice in Hutchinson. I enjoyed working with the clients that uh, I represented. I also represented the city of Hutchinson. And let me just say as an aside that if, you, if a lawyer has an opportunity to do municipal law work uh, as a contract lawyer as I did for the city or as a full-time city uh, attorney, it is a great experience. You will get the opportunity to work on legal issues that you will never see um, in um, so, say a different kind of law practice. Uh, you get First Amendment questions, you get contract questions, you get personnel issues, uh, you get all of the ways in which the public interacts with its municipal government. Absolutely fascinating work, but I'd been doing it for 10, 11 years and um, this opportunity uh, to move to a decision-making role, um, a role different than an advocate, an opportunity to listen to advocates but to make uh, decisions um, based on the arguments that advocates make, uh, that struck me as something that I would be interested in trying. And it's been, as I said, quite a ride and interesting experience.